fact that we deliver the figures makes us confident that this will change. On the other hand side, uh, it seems to be the case, which is not caused by us intentionally, that the Russia uh, 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 motivation has been overpriced by the buyers of our stocks. But as I mentioned, uh, if you compare our bottom line figures from 2007 and our forecast for the years 8, 9 and 10, then you will realize that we deliver what we promise. Uh, thank you. I'm also a Strabag shareholder since your IPO and I'm sticking to my shares. <laughs> <laughs> this, is um, a, this is appreciated. You could find more. <laughs> <laughs> uh, next question, please. Uh, yes, the gentleman here. Thank you. I come from Sudan. We knew Stravag in the 70s. They have done a wonderful job there. Uh, but uh, I believe you have tendered for the Marawi Dam and withdrawn in the last two days before opening the tender. I don't want to say that you have succumbed to American pressure. Uh, you may like to explain whether this is part of your key accounting. Uh, but uh, it fell to the Chinese mainly. But the French also got a bigger slice of $400 million, the electric generation and the power lines and all that. So uh, how do you explain to your shareholders that you have lost uh, this uh, very lucrative uh, project which has already matured now? And, and we, are, we are having seven dams in the Sudan under, under construction in various. Uh, could you come and... Uh, compete again, politics standing aside. Thank you. Could you answer, please? Thank you for this question. Uh, I, understand, I appreciate your frank statement. Uh, it is such that uh, Sudan at the moment is not in the focus of Stravak. Um, I can tell you that I will be in charge for all international activities from 2011 on and I will have a very detailed, detailed look on Sudan because I think there is opportunity and business for Stravak. But uh, there is one fact which I cannot put on these slides and this is the fact that we Stravak are only based in Austria. And Austria is internationally a very small and let me put it frank, irrelevant country. Compared with uh, China, with a very aggressive Af Africa strategy, and France, with, which is a very aggressive uh, strategic player, <coughs> we do not have the, let me put it this way, strategical insurance from our governments that if things go wrong, we get the protection of our governments. Because the state of Austria has no strategy to become a major player in this part of the world. So we need to be sure that we are welcome and that this is a uh, commercial success. A Chinese or French player, con uh, competitor of us, might have a different view because he can be sure and can be assured that their governments will help them out if things go wrong. Thank you. Thank you for a very frank answer. Um, <laughs> Are there any other questions? I see none, so we go now for the coffee break and we meet again at 12. Um, and hear uh, about uh, other, other questions which we have. Thank you, the coffee break. And I would like to thank especially the, Mr. Mavanka and Mr. Kuya for their very uh, interesting speech. I personally learned a lot and perhaps I will buy more Starbucks shares after your intervention, <laughs> Mr. Mavanka. Thank you.